Hello guys, what's up? Welcome back here to another Mad Mobile video. JCN007 here. Hope you guys are having a great day. So anyway, first off, I do apologize for the lack of consistent uploads as of recently. I haven't uploaded in the past couple of days. Um, that only reason is because it's end of the school year, pretty much. It's May 20th. School ends in less than a month. So all the stuff is being crammed in. You have finals coming up, so you definitely have to study for all those tests. So I do apologize for the inconsistent um, uploads, but I do... I um, promise I'll give you guys as much uploads as possible. Um, just some days they're extremely busy, so I can't upload at all. So I do apologize for that in advance. But anyway, right here we do have some new content in Madden Mobile. I was actually kind of surprised to see this. I didn't read any forums about it until I actually logged on today. And I saw this new content. I was like, oh, pretty interesting, um, considering it's near the end of Madden Mobile 16. So right here under your Live Events tab, you probably saw that pop up. It showed you. And right here, we see that Rookie Premier Live event. Unfortunately, it unlocks in about two and a half hours. But um, if you actually play it, it's pretty much similar to the All Rookie Live event, if you guys played that. Um, it looks like it's just a separate Rookie set. So right here, as you can see, it's the typical four stamina live event. And you earn a collectible, um, a Rookie Premier collectible under your rewards. And you get one of these reward packs here. So if you just open one of those up, I'm pretty sure you just get a gold collectible. Maybe you get something better. Um, it really depends. I'm actually not quite sure. So far, I've only pulled those gold signing memorabilia collectibles, um, all of them with different artwork. So anyway, if you go under our sets here, you'll find a couple of stuff. But let's actually go under my team first here. So you actually logged in today. You get one of these reward packs, a uh, premier reward pack. I actually did not really pay attention to what this is. So yeah, it's actually just a free collectible. So pretty much these are collectibles, signing memorabilia collectibles. They're uh, untradeable. And yeah, so it says right here on the back of the card, the live events are up every Thursday and Saturday. So today is Friday, obviously not so sure if they're going to be putting it up tomorrow because that's just one day after. Maybe they will, I'm not entirely sure. But anyway, they go into two different sets, the Premier Exchange as well as the Elite Premier Exchange. I'll show you guys that in just a little bit here. So yeah, that's pretty much the reward pack that you got um, from logging in this morning or whenever you did log in. So if we actually just back out here and go under Sets... Uh, it's not under the Seasonal tab, it's actually under Live Events tab. Um, I was reading some forums and there's actually some type of glitch here. If you guys see on the screen, uh, under Rookery Premier, it says you need 20 collectibles um, for Premier Exchange as well as 20 gold collectibles for Elite Premier Exchange. But in reality, as you can see, it's only out of 10 and this one's only out of 14, so that's not possible. So yeah, I only need 10 of these and it says 20 on the cover. So it looks like Madden Mobile actually originally had it as 20, but they decided to change it. So that's better news for us. Obviously, right here, we can read the information tab right here. Um, just exchange 10 gold collectibles and you get one elite rookie collectible. So it's not a player, it's just a, another collectible. So let's move over to the right here. And this is your elite premier upgrade. As you can see, you do need three specific um, elite collectibles. So it looks like there are only four elite collectibles from exchanging of the 10. And also you just need any 10 random gold premier collectibles. can easily get those from the live event. And yeah, you get yourself an elite player. I'll give you guys... Um, some time to, I'll show you guys some of these elite players, uh, some of the notable ones in just a little bit here. But yeah, you can use one of these, and that goes in the Premier Master Set. So we do have a couple players in the Premier Master Set, and the first one is Carson Wentz. Obviously, he does have a regular rookie card um, in this game. Uh, he has that plus awareness on his stat. Not entirely sure Wentz will be starting uh, immediately for the Eagles this year. It looks like Bradford still has a job, even though... Uh, Bradford looks like he kind of quit there for a little bit, but um, is that throwing power? 99 throwing power. That's really nice. And Carson Wentz, obviously, we know he has a great arm. Um, his accuracy between short, middle, and deep is all very consistent and really nice. Um, decent speed for a quarterback as well. So really nice card there for Carson Wentz in 99 overall card. You just need 20 random elite players, it looks like. Right here, we have Joey Bosa of the Chargers, Ohio State alumni right here. Got that plus one pursuit, 99 overall as well. All these are 99 overall. Pretty solid card, um, 96 Pursuit, 99 Power Moves, 90 Acceleration, 91 Tackle, 95 Strength. Really nice card in Joey Bosa. Moving along here to the right, we have the newly uh, halfback for the Dallas Cowboys. I was surprised that they chose Elliott. I know Elliott is one of the flashiest players in the draft. Definitely will cause a lot of tension. 
But um, they drafted, or they have McFadden, who I thought had a pretty productive year last season. And they also added Alfred Morris. So it's interesting to see. I've actually seen fantasy drafts, if you guys play fantasy football. Um, Elliot goes in the first round, which is pretty crazy. Um, but those are the stats for Elliot. 99 acceleration, 98 ball carry vision. Um, very elusive back right there, 95 speed, 90 agility. Um, really nice card, actually. Definitely looking forward to try him out if I'm able to get him. And this is the one that I really like the best is Jalen Ramsey. If you guys did hear about the news, I think he tore something, um, like partially torn something in his leg or something. Not entirely sure, but I don't know how much how long he's out for. But this guy's an absolute beast. Um, looking at stats right here, 96 speed, 99 acceleration, 96 man, 94 zone, 98 agility. Uh, definitely probably the most expensive card out of all of them because he's a cornerback. Cornerback's a vital position. And those are the only four premier master cards, so you get a little bit of two offense as well as two defense. So that's really nice right there. So I can show you guys uh, why not one of those uh, under the auction house. could just show you a couple of these players that are currently going. Obviously, you saw this Premier Rookie Masters, but there are a couple of 96 overall cards, um, just our regular Premier Rookie cards. And yeah, so we can start off with uh, Goff, obviously. Goff is one of them. He's, they featured Carson Wentz instead of Goff on this one. 99 overall. Nine, oh, my bad. Not 99 overall. That's his draft card. 96 overall. For Jared Goff right here. Here's the card. Pretty expensive. You get bids for over 300k for a 96 overall quarterback. We can go ahead and compare stats. Why not? Right here. To Brady, obviously faster. Um, better accuracy deep and short, surprisingly. Um, you see one, two, three, four, five green compared to this card. Um, exactly the same thing. So I'm not so sure if it's big of a difference. This one has a little more speed. So obviously some little stats vary. But Goff is a major one that you can definitely get. Another one would be Ronnie Stanley, another 96 overall, the offensive guard or tackle, I believe, um, right here for the Baltimore Ravens, I believe. I'm not entirely sure. I think so, right? Yeah, the Ravens. Um, really nice card, actually, compared to Brian Balaga. He's got um, really nice stats, so another top 96 overall card you can pull. And the final one is DeForest Bunkner, um, Oregon, I believe. This guy was an absolute monster. Um, we'll see a stats right here. DeForest Bunkner, uh, drafted by the San Francisco 49ers right here. Compared to 99 JJ, JJ Watt, obviously won't have the nicest stats, but I mean, looking uh, like a really nice card compared to his other card. Pretty similar in stats. So, really nice card. Those are pretty much the most notable ones at 96 overall. There's obviously a bunch of other ones uh, like Hargraves at 93, you have Tunsil at 92. Uh, Corey Coleman at 91 overall, so Derrick Henry at 90, Paxton Lynch at 90 as well, so all of them vary. Um, the minimum is 90 overall to 96 overall, so that's what the overall is value in. Uh, but anyway guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll have another pack opening coming out tomorrow. As you can see, I do have some special packs there. Might as well open them for you guys tomorrow to enjoy. But anyway guys, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time with another video. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love